Hello everyone, welcome back in Java FX tutorial session. This is another video for you. In this tutorial session, we are going to embed swing components, means swing controls in Java FX application. And here I am going to use FXML based application. So guys, we are going to do to embed swing component in Java FX application. For this purpose, we need swing node class and we will use the instance of this class so first we need to create the instance of this class after that we have to call set content method of this class on either javafx thread or event dispatcher thread this is the most important thing of this tutorial session however to access the swing content Ensure that your code runs on EDT because the standard swing threading restrictions will apply. Now guys, I will explain you this thing in the code. And here on this notepad, I have given the code for that purpose, how we are calling the set content method on JavaFX application thread. So simply I have created one method in which I am doing that activity. So we have to use swing utilities class and then we are calling the invoke letter method and we are using the runnable implementation and we are overriding its run method inside this run method we are calling our set content method of swing node class and we are passing the one argument here which is the swing component so I, in this example i am using the j button so i am passing the j button instance so i have just created new j button if you want to use different you can pass the swing control here that means a new instance of that swing component i will explain more in the netbeans ide let me take you inside the netbeans ide and guys this is my netbeans ide 8.0 on the left hand side look at here i have created the java fx project this is the fxml based project and this is simply created we have one controller file we have one fxml file we have one class file which has a start method so guys first i will show you from where you have to start so first thing we have to open the fxml and here we have to assign the fx id to this anchor pen so in this example anchor pen is the base pen i am assigning the fx id to this anchor pen because i want to use the instance of this anchor pen here in the controller file i hope this is clear now we will start from the beginning of this file look at the line number 30 at the fxml notation and i am using this reference object of anchor pine class and my anchor this is the fx id which I have just given in the fxml and this is the default code so i'm not explaining this one and the important thing written inside this initialize method as you know we have to use the swing node instance so we have created one instance of swing node then we are calling the create swing content method and we are passing swing node as an argument here why because because we need to call the set content method on javafx application thread for this purpose we have written this code and the method is present here at line number 49 look at here now the important thing look inside the method we have to use swing utilities method and we have to call invoke letter and then we are using the runnable instance runnable implementation okay and this is the interface which has run method so we are overriding this method and inside this method we are writing our code to add our swing component on javafx so we are calling swing node dot set content method and we are passing the instance of our j button in this example i am trying to add a simple j button on the JavaFX application. So guys, this is the important code which I have written. I hope this is clear. Now, 
come back here in the initialize method once you've done this thing now the last line you have to call the my anchor dot get children dot add then you have to pass this swing node so this will add your swing node that means your control on the JavaFX stage and that will appear so guys this is done now I will take the clean build of this project and I'll, I will run it uh, the statement at line number 45 is most important don't forget it now take the clean build of our project if your project is not set as a main project please set this as a main project and you can simply go here on this run menu and just select clean and build and guys here build is successful now I'm going to run it so I'm going here you can simply do a right click here and select run as a file or you can click the play button to run this so I'm doing run file I think stage is launched but minimized I need to restore it now we will see where is our G button now we found click me and this is your swing J button which is present on the stage but guys there is no action handler is attached with this button as you can see there is action handler attached with the JavaFX button but no action handler attached with this swing button you can attach uh, action handler with this button but I will explain that thing in my upcoming next tutorial on this same session I hope you guys found this tutorial relevant and useful please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel and guys for now thanks for watching cool IT help